I'm getting blow ups. Hey, what's going on? It's Matt. I am out on the California Delta in the new canoe pursuit again. I really did want to get this boat out on a calm day, but that's just not in the cars for me. So um, I plan on doing a little bit more of talking about how I feel about this boat on the water. Later this week, I'll post a video on the walkthrough and some of the changes that I think they need to make and also the things that I really love about this boat because there's quite a few things. Uh, I'm waiting for some buddies to get out on the water. I'm gonna try to catch some fish for y'all and see what happens. Sidebar, like, I've had this thing for the NRS Chinook for, I don't know, a couple weeks now. I'm still not fully used to it. Uh, I have it super loose right now, so I'm thinking maybe that's what needs to be done when I wear it, is just to kind of keep it loose. Uh, but, you know, I know it's one of the top of the line PFDs out there. I'm just having trouble getting, getting used to it because I'm so used to fishing out of an inflatable. That sucker in the wind. <laughs> All right, all the skunks out of the boat. <laughs> See you later, little guy. Whoa! Oh, that's a... All right, a little uh, fish right there. We're all like on top of each other. <laughs> Finally. Yep. Come on. Okay, so I want to talk about the boat real quickly. Um, what I'm really loving about the boat is this huge open layout. That drawer underneath is epic. I can just shove my soft plastics underneath there as well. The rod storage on the floor is fantastic as well. I'm enjoying that and the padding uh, is fantastic. I don't know if this is stock or if Romel actually put this on himself. So uh, this is a 13 and a half foot boat and it's super, you know, super stable. And I think I said that in the last video, I've stood on this a couple of times. I wasn't catching anything and that's kind of why wasn't filming but 
I like the stability of the boat. This is another windy day out on the California Delta and I'm getting pushed all around. And last time I said it's not really the boat's problem, but at the end of the day, you need a rudder on this boat. And uh, I'll say it and it's not bashing the maneuverability of this boat, which is absolutely fantastic, and the paddability. I don't even know if that's a word, but this boat paddles very, very well. But it does need some sort of secondary kind of steering system uh, to keep it on track, and I think a rudder would handle that pretty well. Let's throw this grass burner. <laughs> What are you throwing the tickle me almost frog? How do you know? <laughs> I'm getting blow ups. Oh, that was crazy. That was the craziest catch. <laughs> kind of just, uh, I don't know, that was weird. Got one? Yeah. First top water. God, it's been forever. I know, right? It's been a bad year for top water. Just like, just a reaction strike is what I'm looking for. Hey, man. <laughs> Hold on. Ah, uh, we gotta turn around. You gotta turn around? Yeah, absolutely. freaking God damn it. I mean... You know what? I don't, I think we can make it. Let's see if I can't get over here. Almost there! So this is super low tide, and I made it through. I hope the two guys behind me, I hope Bet and Josh make it through. Uh, it's been a rough day of fishing for me, you know. A little fish and still good time though. Probably in eight inches to 12 inches of water, maybe. That was something very big. I just spooked something very big. Yeah, they're all, they're all going like that. So we're going to close up the video here. We are going to walk our kayaks back somehow to the car. I have no idea what we're going to do. These two guys, I have no idea. I wish the camera was that way now. 
but uh, we're kind of far from the launch, so Josh's lovely five. wife is picking us up and we're gonna go back and get our cars, but I don't know how we're getting our kayaks up here. The new canoe performed really well in shallow water, not so hot in the wind. Stay tuned, later this week, I will do a full walkthrough and review of the kayak. Thanks for watching these things. I'm gonna die. Bet's gonna die. Have a great day. Talk to you soon.